suspect was later identified so we'll see what's going on with this video. Hill. Uh, east, first street. Look for police or paramedics? Uh, police. We have uh, an intruder here at the, uh, the front desk of the hotel, and he has a knife. Is he threatening he somebody? Wanna, yes, he doesn't want to leave the, uh, the front desk. What's the name of the hotel? Los Angeles. Is he black, white, Hispanic, Asian? Uh, he's white. Okay. He has a knife right now. Okay. I'll get the police going. Is the knife in his hand? Yes, he has it in his hand right now. Like a kitchen knife or what kind of knife? It's a long uh, black knife. And he threatened you guys with it? Yes. Okay. We have our security guard right here and our valet attendant. Okay. But he has a knife. Hold on, okay. I'm going to get the police going. Don't hang up. I have some more questions. Okay. Central United States UW suspect they're now East First Street of a hotel front desk suspect Mel White armed with a long black knife threatened staff it's code three incident seven zero one or D one twenty eight Central Hill identified. So did you say Mel White or Mel Smith? Mel White. Mel White green jacket with the hat on baseball cap with blue jeans. Yeah, that's Mel White. Okay. Yeah, that's Mel White. Yeah, he's there. Let's get him in a bit. Where is he? In the air. Want the 40? My window's down. No, get your gun. I think this guy that got out of the passenger seat, he's uh, he's a training officer. And just by the questions he asked, and I also think they should have brought the less lethal hand shotgun, but I think that's part of the problem with policing. They didn't even try. They just said, no, nope, just, just bring your gun. There was two of them there, and I'm not criticizing these guys' office, these officers' decisions. I'm just saying that I think they should have brought it. I mean, one could have the, the 40 mil, the 44 mil, and the other one could have a real live ammunition. I mean, if one don't work, use the other one. But that's my opinion, and I think that's the problem with police work. And you're always going to get someone like me to criticize, but I'm not criticizing. I'm just giving my opinion. Drop the knife. Take the knife out of your pocket and drop it on the floor. Face the wall. Face the wall right now. Face the wall. You don't have a gun, you have a flashlight. Face the wall. You don't have a flashlight. Face the wall. You're not cops. Hey, you're not cops. Hold on, can I get back up? So if you want to watch the unedited version of this um, video with no commentary from me, it'll be linked in the video card at the top of the screen, somewhere over here, up here somewhere. <laughs> um, but as always, thanks for watching, and let me know what you think in the comments.